Before you start using the MCAD Co-Designer plugin, you'll need to download it from the Downloads page at Altium.com. On this page, look for the MCAD Co-Designer Plugins section and download the extension that matches your MCAD software. You'll need to close your MCAD application before installing the Co-Designer extension. Download the installation file and then run it to install the plugin. When you open Autodesk Inventor, the plugin may not launch automatically. To unlock it, go to the Add-in Manager, then find and highlight Altium Co-Designer in the list of available plugins. Disable Block and enable Load Automatically and Loaded, and then restart Autodesk Inventor. The Co-Designer panel is hidden by default, and it should be opened before you start using the add-on. To do this, first create a new document. Then, click the plus icon in the sidebar and select Altium Co-Designer. Now, you can close the new document and the panel will remain enabled in the interface. After opening the panel, enter your email and password and click the Sign In button. A PCB can include a huge number of 3D component models. It's recommended to keep all these component models in one place. In the Co-Designer settings, you can specify a common folder where components from your projects will be saved. After the electrical engineer pushes the board from Altium Designer, an MCAD user can access the board by pressing the Pull button. Select the project you want to open, click OK, select a location to store the project, and wait for the download to complete. Now, you can use the Co-Designer plugin to quickly and easily collaborate with your electrical engineer. For a more detailed overview of the MCAD Co-Designer features, we recommend you watch the rest of the videos on the Altium Academy YouTube channel.